we are now arriving at the top of Mount Chiliad. And we're going to toss this truck down the mountain. This is Azinium and General here with the uh, really nice vehicle. Really nice view on the top of Mount Chiliad. Uh, this, this vehicle was uh, featured in the Mariachi Easter Egg uh, video. And we wanted to uh, make a point as to how durable... This vehicle is now. This is a very fantastic uh, starter vehicle. Uh, as you can see, you can have uh, two people in the bed of the truck. You can have two people in the front, and then you can actually have two people in the back. So that is uh, quite a bit of space, considering you can just find this vehicle uh, in specific locations. So yeah, alright guys, here we go, we are hooked, uh, get ready for uh, absolute carnage, and when I say carnage, I the mean, sign looks the most insane. I, I'm talking about the absolute durability of this vehicle that you can get, uh, maybe just for durability's sake. Maybe just for the fact of, uh, you know, maybe you want something that will really get you through, you know? Uh, when when the, the uh, thing first starts, you know what I mean? When you first start out, you just want a, a reliable vehicle that you can trust, you know? A vehicle that you know, for a fact, will be able to stand the test of time. This, my dear friends, is that vehicle. Easy to find extremely durable to terrain. Uh, as you can see, we're just, you know, completely... Actually, I'm taking more damage than the vehicle right now, to be 100% honest. I mean, look at this thing. We're still... We're still intact. We're still intact. Still there going. Go. Still going. We might be in a bit of a per predicament right here. Let's see if we can get out of here, or if General's gonna have to wedge us up. Nope, we're good. We're good. We're good. There we go. We're gonna go full throttle. No, what's what's the what's the saying? No holds barred. Oh, there we go. Still going. I I honestly I I definitely recommend this vehicle for for really. Uh, really anyone if you're looking for a great starter vehicle so uh, any any disagreements there general no. I'm actually I'm actually decently impressed do you wanna do you want to drop it down the mountain again give it see see if it'll take the the chili sure. times two all right I don't know. I, I kind of figured it'd make it down chili at once. Uh, and we're not even smoking. So, uh, yeah. Let's give it a time to. Yeah. Alright, guys. We are upping the stakes. We are at max height. Uh, let's see if this vehicle can take the maximum amount of carnage. Drop her when you're ready, General. Here we go. Three, two, one. Adios. All right, guys, here we are in our nice little uh, vehicle. We survived the Chiliad once. <laughs> I don't know about this. Oh, wow. Oh, 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 yeah, boy. We survived it, man. And this vehicle is a little bit worse for wear. <laughs> We're getting down the Chiliad a second time. Man, why would you not want this vehicle? You would be ridiculous to not own this vehicle. Even to impress someone or make a bet, you know, I bet you I can drop a vehicle from max height onto Chiliad and survive it twice. Guess who's going to be winning that bet? Not the other guy. Not the guy betting against you. I am intentionally and deliberately running into rocks when I can. 
I am really beating this thing up. We're doing flips. We're we're spinning. Um, honestly, my my guy is not doing too well, just because of the damage I've personally taken from such a uh, traumatic experience. Oh, let the train hit you. Let the train hit oh, me. Oh no, you're not gonna be able to get out of there. Am no, I? Oh, come late. on! No. Yeah, you can probably get ahead of it. I mean, I do realize what you're saying. I can probably get ahead of it with the vehicle that just took excruciating trauma, by the way. Oh. I didn't really get hit too well, but not bad. Oh, wow. I, I just think this is a very solid vehicle. Alright guys, we're doing a quick damage check on this vehicle. Uh, General is uh, coming over here to uh, inspect it because he has more time on this vehicle. Uh, so far, my initial observations are uh, it is pretty smushed in. Uh, all the tires are intact. Uh, yeah, not bad. Let's see, can we still get in the back? I can't tell. Try, try and see if you can still get in the back. Okay, there we go. See if I can get in the back still. Oh, yeah, I can still get in the back. Let me see if I can still get in the back seat. Okay, let's see. What do we got? Back seat. Yeah? Okay, so the truck is still totally usable. Not smoking at all, mind you. After a drop from max height and a drop down Chiliad two times... Um, what's your assessment on uh, the driving and maneuverability capability? When I was driving it, uh, I when I was driving it down the uh, Chiliad, even though it was pretty it's rough, it was really smooth. Drive straight. Yeah, really smooth. Meaning, so far this thing has taken enough of a beating that any other car, honestly, I feel like would have taken an indent at the wheels. This thing is still driving straight. Yeah. Let's see about the turning radius. Pretty good. Hmm? Yeah. I think that's a, a tighter turning radius than some of the even it has undamaged vehicles. Acceleration, just a tad bit. Fair enough. Wow. That's incredible. Truly incredible. Do right, you want to go for a third run? Let's yeah, let's go for a third one run, guys. Uh, are we doing ma max height again? Mm, might as well. Let's do max height again. Yeah. I, there's already going to be questions like, how many times at max height can you drop it down, Chiliad? Because the first time we didn't do max height. If you guys want to see that video, let us know. But we're going to do a third run here. I'll be back once we get to uh, the top of uh, Chiliad. Wow, this is insane. All right, guys, I have taken some snacks because my health, I don't think I would have made it through. Uh, we are at max height right now. I am honestly terrified. Uh, all right, General, do your countdown. Let's see, let's see what happens. Three, two, one, down you go. All right, here we go, guys. Down the Chiliad again. We might detonate this time. And you know what? If we do, I'll be, I'll still be impressed. Oh, no. Wow. Okay. 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 Now we just got to make it down the mountain without detonating. <laughs> this is so ridiculous. <laughs> Oh my god. This thing has taken such a beating. <laughs> I honestly want to try this with a tank with the barrel. <laughs> oh man, this is like a meme at this point. Alright, here we go. Oh my god, the bison might be stronger than the Kanjali. <laughs> <laughs> That explosion 
wise, but from taking a beating down a mountain, maybe. Yeah. Yikes. We need to, we need to, yeah. We should definitely compare things. I almost wanted to take, um, are there vehicles down this now? Yeah, just to see, like, how much vehicles can actually take. Because I've taken a couple vehicles down the Chiliad, and I'll say this, they have not really made... They've not made it very far. I've detonated a couple times. At the very least, at the very least, I get, you know... I'll get, uh... You stop moving. Yeah. I have stopped moving, but I am stuck. I don't know if you can actually get... Oh, wait, wait. Oh, nope, we're good. We're good, we're good. Once again... Oh, and there's the train. To finish oh, us off. smashed into the train. Uh, yep, yep, yep. And we are not smoking. I guess we just take it back up to the top. God. All right, we'll be back. All right, guys, this is going to be a little bit more difficult. Low visibility. We are at max build height. Go ahead and give us the countdown, General. Three. Here we go. Two. One. Down you go. This is so ridiculous. You know, it, I, I'm, I'm almost convinced that any vehicle just dropped from max build height onto sharp surfaces would just detonate. But no, not this truck. This truck's just perfectly fine with it. I'm, I'm still trying to lose that door, but it, I just can't. No matter <laughs> what I do. Built wise and tough. <laughs> tough. Bravado tough, that's what it is. Man. Dude. I'm, I'm still fine, by the way. Perfectly fine with this. That's insane. I, I'm not even sure what it is at this point. Like I said, it's just becoming a meme. To me, anyways. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Like I'm I'm not if you guys can see Oh, I thought I thought I saw some fire there. Nope, just sparks. We're fine. <laughs> Man. That's incredible. I, I'm I'm not even sure what's happening anymore at this point, guys. Th this can't be normal. This isn't normal, is it? No, this can't be normal. All right, here we go. Up oh, there's the train again. Perfect timing. All right, here we are this once again. Four? That was four. <laughs> yeah, I guess we'll go for a fifth. <clears throat> Mine is. I I didn't let's know this. How far this thing can go, I dude. didn't think this was gonna be. Let's drop a truck down uh, mountain video the whole time. But I mean, come on, you guys have to admit this is pretty freaking impressive. I'll go ahead and put a timestamp in. I thought. That, I honestly thought this video was gonna be like, let's compare the speed of this truck to other trucks. Let's see how far into the water it can go. But instead, we are testing how many times we can drop it down. I'll show you. I, I knew it was... the max heart. I knew it was durable, but this is just stupid at this point. This thing is stupid durable. So we'll, we'll continue to do this um, live, uh, meaning we'll record it as we drop. That way you guys know we didn't skip anything or toss in an extra number or something like that. To see how many times this guy can actually survive. Uh, if we start getting into uh, 30 minutes of this, then um, this might have to be a completely separate video. Uh, aside from the how to get this vehicle yeah. video. You know, this might just be... Uh, that might be what this video is. This video might just have to be posted the same day. You know what I mean? With a link referencing. Depending, because we're already uh, 15 minutes in, still dropping the the, the truck. I, I'm extremely surprised. Damn. You know? Yeah! <laughs> this thing is insane. This is amazing. Yeah. So we'll, we'll be back when we're back at max height. And uh, yeah. Wow. All right. Here we go. Start the uh, countdown, the General. Fifth run. Three, two, one, 
down you go. Here we go. Down the old uh, Chiliad. Hello, I hope Mountain. you actually go down the right way. My old friend. No, you're not. I'm gonna land on a building. Oh, and I'm oh, fine. That's even better, though. <laughs> Ow. Wow, that was rough. Did you get stuck on a tree? Yes, I did. I might be able to get out of this. I don't know, though. I might need your... I might need your... Oh, uh, wait. Nope, the tree is pushing me out. Oh, I was stuck in a tree. All right. Okay. I'm going to try and wiggle myself out of this. Oh, nope. I'm good. Here we go. Oh, boy. Dude. <laughs> this is so great. I, I don't know how. Oh, still have that door. That door just does not want to come off. <coughs> it's actually... Yeah, I'm convinced that door has been welded onto the rest of the truck. <laughs> it's welded shut. It is actually kind of nice. It's uh, definitely appealing to watch the truck go down during the uh, darker hours because yeah. you see all these sparks flying everywhere as the vehicle just collides with everything and somehow manages to survive. I'm not even sure if this vehicle will ever uh, die at this point. What, what's our what's our max number on this? Would you say ten? Ten droppings, and then we're then we just. I know. don't know. This is our fifth. Yeah, so we do it five more times. I'm, I'd I mean, say you survived the fifth one so far. The train isn't coming this time. Unless it's already passed. Yeah. Oh no! Here comes the train. Oh, and I've completely overshot it. Great. Oh well. Oh, well. Yep, this thing's fine. Dude, that is so stupid. Yes, get ran by the train. <laughs> I mean, oh god, no! I'm helicopter. This helicopter might die before the truck. <laughs> the helicopter's having a lot more issues than the actual truck. All right, I guess we'll be back here again. All right, General, what what uh, what number is this one? This is the sixth drop. Sixth drop. Here we go. Counter down, General. Three, two, one, down you go. Here we are. Hopefully not down the wrong side. That, is there a wrong side at this Probably. point? Probably. <laughs> no, not really, I guess. You are going down a different side, but oh well. I landed right on my front that time. I wasn't even trying to land on my wheels. Really? Yep. And I'm still okay. The helicopter is smoking pretty bad right now. The truck's doing fine. <laughs> <laughs> like I'm, pre I'm pretty sure I'm heating up the earth by still flying this helicopter right now. <laughs> Are you stuck on a rock now? Yeah. Somehow I got the easy side though. So I guess there is a wrong side. What do you know? Yeah. Like, mm, well, let's just not count this. Maybe we'll count this as a half, I guess. I mean, I landed straight on the front of the truck. That should have... True. ...detonated That would have detonated any other vehicle, really. I'm gonna have to get a pop run after this. <laughs> this is unbelievable. So you get the front row seat of watching the truck tumble down the hill then? Yeah. Oh man. The, the, just to and have... the bird's eye view. Wouldn't it be beautiful to have both footages? One of these days, one of these days we'll be able to have that technology to do that. Yeah. That would be amazing. Once I get a working desktop. Yeah. Oh, oh, what is that I see? Is that a little bit of smoke? Maybe? Is that some smoke? We might be smoking a little bit, guys. I am. For sure. Oh my god, dude. You are literally trying to land on the foot of that thing now. Yep. 
which is insane. I want to point out the light on the license plate is still active. Ah, yep, we got a little bit of smoke in here. There might be an actual limit. There we go. I don't know, this was the easy way down. Yeah, I start smoking on the easy way down. Far back. <laughs> yeah, there it is. God. Yeah, I'm definitely I'm smoking. I'm about to throw this thing towards a gas station. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> let's see. <laughs> let's see which one lasts longer: the uh, the helicopter or the truck. <laughs> <laughs> this thing has already stopped its rotors once so far. So. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm, I might have to get a do a cargo bomb run. <laughs> Third. Well, we weren't expecting this, so. No, I I thought it was gonna end three laps ago, three drops ago. So what are we at now? Him. What is this number? Six. Six. I'm I about mean, to drop you down the seven. Are you sure this wasn't seven? Um, I'm pretty sure. Alright guys, this may be our last drop. I am terrified. We are smoking. Uh, the helicopter is not doing too well itself. Um, is it just... Has it been taking damage just from picking me up then or something? No, I got hit by the train. Oh, like, oh. Just... Just the very back end got hit by the train, just a tad bit. Oof. So we but definitely know still. that this truck is more durable than that military-grade helicopter. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Uh, counter down, right. General. Three, two, one. Down you this go. This might be our last run, guys. I there at some point I'm going to die. It's a really sad. Sad story, but you I think know. you're gonna run out of stack snacks before that thing dies. I don't know, man. I think this is it. I can't see it taking much more damage. Oh no! What? What in the world, dude? I'm okay. in 90. Oh, um, the the, the helicopter's stalling. <laughs> <laughs> I might be going down. <laughs> Realize how funny that is to me right now, guys. <laughs> Pick up. God damn, oh, man. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> the truck's fine. I lost the other door finally. <laughs> uh. oh, dude, I saw you coming down. <laughs> Over top of the truck. It was a 90 degree angle. <laughs> oh my goodness. Dude, I saw you coming down, man. That stuff was so funny. Oh, dude, you were in a, a mad dash for the earth. Oh my goodness. I'm in tears. <laughs> I was plummeting 90 degrees. Going straight down. Oh boy. Oh man. That was good. I, I may have a slight issue though. I think I'm I'm wedged into a rock and I'm not sure how to get it out. You wanna give it a go? Yeah. <clears throat> uh, the truck's fine, <laughs> by the way. <laughs> Unlike the military grade helicopter. So. <clears throat> oh, there we go. There we go. Sometimes giving it less throttle saves it. Man, <laughs> that was that was really really funny. <laughs> like cargo. <bomb. laughs> You're like, I think it's stalling out. Oh, oh no, I'm going down. <laughs> the moment I said stalling out, I heard beeping. Um. Yeah, it's it's fine. Yeah, you know this is this is fine. Yeah, <laughs> this is perfectly okay. Unlike the cargo bob that got hit by the train. 
Unlike the cargo bot that is now rolling down the side of a mountain. <laughs> I mean, uh... Dude. This is, this is borderline comical at this point. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm in tears. <laughs> I gotta find a cargo bot now. <laughs> Oh god! All right, guys. I guess we'll be back. Uh, oh my oh, goodness! The car, the truck stalled. Did it? Did it? Yeah. So it didn't. Oh yes. no! Oh, it's not dead, but it's stalled. Oh, okay. We can still drive it. I have to go to Grape Scene to get a cargo bob. Okay. <clears throat> so we are having some like issues that. with the vehicle. <laughs> All right. I guess I'll wait for you here. Um, yeah. Oh my god, dude. I'll, uh... I'll, uh... I'll let you guys know when we get back. Um, we'll see, uh... We'll see you then. Oh my goodness. Alright, guys. Time 8. Uh... Man. I, I don't even know anymore. I, I don't know if I'm gonna live or die. Down before this second. Yeah. The helicopter is meant to carry tanks across a map. Died out before... A truck you can get off the streets. <coughs> That's amazing. All right, General, All go right, ahead and uh, give me a, uh, I guess, a dropping. Go ahead and uh, count down. Three, two, one. Adios. Here we go, guys. And so far, so good. This is, uh, mildly concerning, it's, I'd have to say. Ow, ow, wow, that actually really hurt. <laughs> <clears throat> the, the animals who live on the side of this mountain are so angry at us for dropping this down. They're starting to throw rocks at you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> they like <laughs> low slingshots out of the fiber from the trees. They're like, what are those no, shooting at you? What are those stupid humans doing? <laughs> Out of everything you guys could have done, this. Could you imagine like the oh local, the local residents here, having to constantly hear the brutal smashing of a cart, breakneck <laughs> speed hike, rushing down a hill. Trail. Yeah, all they hear is whap 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 whap, car whap whap, car 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 car. And then beeping from a helicopter going down. <laughs> Man. Alright. We're doing pretty good. <laughs> I think. I guess we'll meet you guys we back up there. Do a damage check. That. Let's just keep no, going, I, I guess. See the damage pretty well so far. <laughs> Alright, guys, we're at number nine. Uh, go ahead and start the countdown, General. <clears throat> Three, two, one, down you go. There we go. You know, every <clears throat> dude. Every time I hit, I I always I'm like, all right, this is the time that it's gonna detonate on me, and I'm gonna and I'm like, at this point, it's gonna be a jump scare because I don't know when it's actually gonna happen. <laughs> and I'm like, all right, here it is. Here's the time. Here's the time that it detonates. <laughs> and then the truck is like, no. That was Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> this is not how I want to go down. I want to go down and get the tank. I mean, General, you're getting a nice bird's eye view. You can tell that <clears throat> this 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 truck is not getting you are hitting nice every treatment on the way down. Yeah. You are on your roof right now. At times, I'm just bouncing. Oh, you hit, you hit your grill. That, that's that's <laughs> engine damage there. You hit the grill again. 
Like this is Dude. this is absolute punishment. It's never gonna die. <laughs> <laughs> this is just purgatory. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and uh, well, there's nine. <sighs> this is ridiculous. Okay, guys, we're back up here at max height. Um, I guess go ahead and do For the customary 10. countdown, general. Yeah, uh, drop ten. Here we go. Three, two. One, down you go. That was the wrong bump. Well, I activated the radio. Seems to still do the, uh, still do the same amount of work. Oh, okay. Well, do it. <laughs> this truck, man. It, it's literally just a husk, but it it still is fine. <clears throat> Man, this is this this thing's been through an absolute blender of Chiliad. <clears throat> wow. You know, for for all all normal purposes, I I'd, I'd say this thing had basically if you're a normal player and you're not tossing your vehicle, oh, oh, I'm seeing fire, guys. I'm actually seeing fire. Wait, really? Yeah. I'm seeing fire. Dude, I was just about to say if we reach 15, I'm throwing you into the windows. <laughs> <laughs> and now you're seeing fire? Yeah. I'm still going, but I'm definitely seeing fire. <laughs> oh, and I've oh, died. Right wow! The tracks, dude. Wow! Oh, wow! Yeah, I, I need to pause this to collect left. my uh, my thoughts real quick. All right, guys. Ten, dude. Ten times. Ten times down, Chiliad. Now. Wow. Uh, honestly, I, I'm I'm impressed because, like I like I said, there's been a couple uh, a couple vehicles that I've just detonated from rolling, or I landed landed on something wrong. <clears throat> that that vehicle just would not, you know, even uh, I don't even know. It just wouldn't give up. No. So we're. Uh, uh, General, you said we're kind of in the area right now where this vehicle spawns, then? Yes. In the, uh, Pleto area, we're really our countryside. <clears throat> yeah. So this is the area that you'll want to find it in, over here. Um, we're hopefully going to find one, and then I'll do a quick, uh, customization job. Even if you can find it for free on the streets. It's only like thirty-five, maybe forty thousand dollars. Bio. No. I mean, well, it's I, really not an expensive vehicle. Uh, especially for how impressive it is. <clears throat> if you're ever yeah. worried about any environmental damage, or you're trying to get something done, and you know you want to uh, get there and back without worrying about landing wrong or taking a hill wrong or hitting a rock too hard the the vehicle does not the, does not give up at all it doesn't care <clears throat> it just doesn't care what it's hitting no we literally this video I, is I, honestly, 34 I think minutes the truck just got bored with us <laughs> dude it took about... so long for that to die it's only you and I in the server now yeah, that literally we've thrown the truck down the hill for so long that a this video is double the recommended amount, but I'm sure you guys are interested nonetheless because I mean, come on. That's definitely entertaining. 
We're gonna we're gonna fly around a little bit. Is that it right there? No, definitely not. And see if we can find one. Um, yeah. Wow, that was brutal. All right, so we found this not too hard to find, guys. Uh, we found ours right here uh, at this location. But uh, General, you said you found yours just free roaming the highway, right? Yeah, it was down in Harmony near Sandy Shores. Now these things, um, if you can't find one, they are uh, pretty cheap. Um, I think you can pick one up for about uh, thirty thousand, and yeah, yeah. Uh, customizations, I'd say they're they're all the all the standard ones, right? Just all the basic ones. Yeah. I, I think you can do what a tow hook as well. All the all the standard truck customizations. No. No tow hook? I thought I was reading on the um on the no. wiki. Uh, maybe for a mighty you know bush. For the mighty vehicle. bush ver version, yeah. Okay. Well, so uh, it already has a tow hook on it. There are special variants of the of uh of the um, bison itself that we have here. Um. So if you want to see us get the rare ones, let us know because I would be totally down for that. I'm I'm uh, I'm fine to have this one and the two other uh, special bison variants, uh, if need be. But yeah, so that's it. This thing can take a heck of a beating. Um, at this point, you know, feel free to drive it. Feel free to smash it into whatever you want. Because I don't, I don't think the vehicle will, will really care at all. I, I think the only thing it won't survive is probably, uh, you know, detonations. I think. So. Mm -hmm. It's a one tap with detonations, right, uh, General? Most likely. Yeah, I believe so. Okay. Yeah. So yeah. And then, um, I, let's see how much it sells for. Probably not very much. Oh, I can't sell it right now. It probably doesn't sell for very much, considering you can just find it right off the road and grab it. But, uh, yeah, all in all, it's a really nice, nice, uh, vehicle. I'm, uh, I'm pretty happy that we did this video. Like I said, I apologize that this is a 40-minute long video. Here for the magic touch? Um, yeah, but, uh... I love a freaking video, guys. I'd say it's worth it. Oh, yeah, definitely. Yeah, so it, it looks like wheels, turbo, all the standard vehicle stuff. Um, but, yeah, like you said, General, it looks like you'd have to get the special one to unlock the other uh, the other stuff for it. But you know what? I'm pretty happy. I don't know if you can customize the other stuff. Yeah, who knows? Sometimes the I other ones know. are static. Uh, I'd say that this vehicle is pretty freaking... Uh, Pretty freaking rad, uh, considering uh, everything that, uh, yeah. Uh, yep, definitely doesn't take an explosion from a gas tank, so we know that. Anyways, this has been Azinium in general, and we will see you guys next time. Wait, before I before I end, general, do you have anything to say about this? Anything else to say? No. Aside from the sheer insanity thing survived 10 laps on, on Chiliad. I'm... There we go. Oh.